Hi, I'm John Wallace from the University of Maryland. And what I was talking about this morning was the concept of limited and open access societies. The key question is really how do societies organize themselves to limit violence? And in most societies, limited access societies, the political system limits access to valuable privileges like economic, social, religious privileges in order to create rents and uses those rents to coordinate the political system and therefore provides order. In open access societies, everyone is allowed to form economic, political, and social organizations and the competition between those organizations is what disciplines the political system. So rather than the political system manipulating the economy, the economy creates conditions under which the polity can guarantee property rights and freedom.